You look terrible. Yeah, so do you. You're not gonna answer your phone? Text? Why? So you can tell me that dad died? Sister already told me, so. Can I come in? Yeah, fine, come in. Where's a uh, pisser? You mean wizard? Yeah, she's around. Can I get you something to drink? Yeah, that, that would be great, thanks. This is a dump. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Perfect. Now everybody could just run off and make something themselves like you, right? You're not gonna give me a drink? I am far from perfect. But then again, I don't squander every opportunity that I get. No. You don't get to say that. You have no idea what it was like. Look, all I'm saying is that you, dad's favorite, had every opportunity to be successful. I mean, heck, full ride scholarship, Mr. All-Star. And what did you do? You got drunk on graduation night and totaled dad's truck. <laughs> yeah, I would be just as pissed as he was. You really want to do this today of all days? Look, I am willing to set aside our differences for the time being. But as far as this reconciliation that you're trying to force, it's not going to happen. So stop. No, because the difference is I had to work hard for everything that I got. And you did not make it any easier. And sure enough, Dad didn't. Okay? Between you and your goons bullying me and him, Beating me? Because I'm not as good as you? Yeah. Yeah, I hold little remorse for you. Hello? You, do you want to do this right now? Let's just get this over with. Yeah, grab your jacket. It's cold. It's been a minute. You know, they're going to name this park after Dad. Figures. Community loves them more than us, right? When was the last time you were here? <laughs> Do you remember when, uh, when Dad would make us run laps or mouthing off? He really pushed us, didn't he? No, he pushed you. What do you mean? He beat me. I just figured that I liked the sport more than you did, that's all. Do you think maybe because dad loved this sport so much that he wanted us to do better than him? And maybe in some weird way, this was how he showed how much he loved us was just pushing as hard as he did. What I mean is, Dad prioritized you. He saw your talent, your skill. He saw how fierce you were. Your love for the game. Same love that he had for it. Me, I was rebellious. I, I fought hard against it. And as soon as I could, I quit. This place, this was your paradise. For me, it was my prison. And I hated it here. If that is the way that he shows how he loves people, 
That's messed up. And maybe that's just the way he showed how he loved you. I couldn't even get him to respect me. You know, the, the night you crashed his truck, you barely got a slap on the wrist. Dad was only devastated because he could no longer live his dream through you. You know, he, you were no longer the all-star player that he expected from you. So yeah, you know what? Maybe I am jealous. But it's not of your talent and your skill. It's that he treated you better than me. It's that you never got what I got. You got a taste, you know. As soon as you were out, did Dad saw you know you're no longer useful, right? I ran. I ran as soon as I could. He saw a fighter in you. True contender. So you made me the punching bag. I had no idea. I thought... Honestly, that you were jealous. Now, Dad was spending all this time with me. I was trying. I showed him that I, I cared. I fought. I mean, you weren't really a mama's boy, but you were mom's boy, right? I just thought, you know, we were different people. We don't think the same. We don't act the same. We were just two sides of the same coin. I, I didn't know dad treated you like that. I was... Say, I was just so caught up in what I was doing. I, I didn't pay attention. I know it's late, but I am really sorry. You're better off dead than alive. You know, mom's gonna kill you.